Since then, our private sector partners, including Banner Health, SonoraQuest, LabCorp, TGen, and Mayo Clinic, have begun conducting COVID-19 tests, resulting in over 44,000 tests completed so far. But we need more, a lot more. And there's not a governor in the country who doesn't need more testing with a greater availability of tests and more rapid turnaround of results. In addition to more diagnostic testing, nationally, there's been talk about what's called antibody testing. It's a blood test, which has the potential to determine if someone has been exposed to the virus, had COVID-19 and recovered. I'm certain we all know people that were sick in January or early February and wonder if they indeed did have COVID-19. Here in Arizona, we're not just talking about that, we're taking action for our citizens. That's why I'm pleased to announce a new partnership with the University of Arizona to make an initial 150,000 that's 250,000 of these antibody tests available for Arizonans, starting with our frontline medical personnel and first responders. Now, antibody testing is not a cure-all, but it's an important step to identifying community exposure, helping us make decisions about how we protect our citizens and getting us to the other side of this pandemic more quickly. Our health workers and first responders are on the front lines, and my top priority is to identify ways to protect them, and I'm eager to get this underway.